Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. Now today I've got another episode of the Hidden Gem on NAR series. Now today we're going to be doing a player, a, the Ivory Coast striker from the Bundesliga 2, Didier Yaconen, who I did actually use a fair amount on FIFA 13. He had an inform at Hanover on FIFA 13. I did use that quite a lot. Um, he has dropped in pace quite a lot and he has dropped in rating quite a decent amount since then. But he still took a pretty interesting card and to be honest, a pretty good card for a uh, silver card and not very expensive at all. Picked him up for about 500 coins actually. No, I think it was about 1.4k actually, not 500 coins. So he's fairly expensive, but he's, he's not he's not too expensive. He's in that kind of 1k to 2k uh, price or area you can probably get him for. He might even be a bit cheaper. I'm not 100% sure. But we're going to get into a review of this guy. Now, getting into his in game stats, he's got some pretty decent and certain really well rounded, actually, to be fair, for a silver card. Most of his stats are in the 70s, which for a silver card is really good. He's got 76 acceleration, 79 sprint speed. 81 agility, 79 balance, 76 balance, 78 ball control, 79 dribbling, shooting he's got 75 and 75 position, 76 shooting and all around a lot of 70s you can see there in shooting he's got very solid stats, jumping 82 as well, he looks like a very very well rounded card. How he felt for me was he, was, he got into good areas, I think his positioning it was like mid 70s I think it was and he does have decent positioning but his reactions it's just it feels quite poor. Like if you'll get into you'll get into a lot of good positions, you can and you'll get to a position where you think right this is a goal, and you'll go to pull the trigger, and he'll just be he'll just be that split second too slow, and the um, defender would have come in and tackle him unfortunately. So he didn't get as many goals as I was maybe hoping he would get because of that. I think in the end he got about uh, I think he got four goals in six games, which is pretty decent still so for a striker of um, 1.2k, and he does have really solid stats. But like I said, his reactions are um, a little bit annoying at times. Now, what this guy did good for me is just get into the box and just like be in there. He has got a decent amount of pace, even though it's 79. He has got a decent amount of strength, I think. I've, well, I don't think his strength's actually that good. What I'd recommend doing with this guy is doing most of the work with the um, with the wingers or the midfielders, like the centre attacking mid, and just getting this guy the, the ball onto this guy because when he's got the ball, he has got a decent finish on him. I mean, I know his, I said his reactions were pretty um, irritating at times. But when he does pull the trigger, when he does get the shot away, his finishing is pretty clinical and he will score most shots that you do take with this guy. So in the end, I'm going to give this guy a 6.5 out of 10. Even though I gave this guy a reaction and said this guy's reactions were pretty poor, in finishing, which is what a striker is meant to do, he was pretty clinical. And also his pace felt a lot faster than 79, so that is something to take into account as well. And for 1.2k, I would definitely recommend it giving this guy a try. If you are making a uh, Ivory Coast team or thinking of making some sort of hybrid that you can get him into, um, obviously Bolly plays for Dusseldorf which is the club that you can and plays for. So and he's Ivory Coast as well so you can get him into a hyperlink and get him into hybrids that way which uh, would be pretty interesting to do. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have then be sure to like button down below and also be sure to put in the comments down below as well any players you want me to do in the next episodes. Uh, make sure that at least attackers or like right wingers, left wingers or strikers and I'll be sure to do them in the next episode. So, hope you guys have enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. See you later.